Hi everyone, uh, travel addict uh, guy here. I'm in Alicante and I'm gonna go to Benidorm today, guys. Never been to Benidorm, it's gonna be the first time. And I actually found out you can take the tram and this is actually the tram station here. And it's not too far from this uh, market there. And you actually go down in here, guys. So I've been passing this place lots of times, but I've never been down in there. So now I know that's where the tram is. Let's go, guys. Let's take the tram to Benidorm. Looks like I have to buy a ticket from the machine. I have to wear the mask, unfortunately, in the in the tram guys it's mandatory okay guys it costs 640 a round trip to go to benadar and back it's not too bad We're gonna have to go in the entrance over here here we go and it's just a paper ticket guys that's all it is there we go you have to scan it there we can head down into the metro okay guys you can see we are in mercado and we are gonna head all the way to Benidorm today. There it is, guys, and where are we? So we're all the way here. So it looks like a long trip. So not bad, guys, for 340 each direction. That is pretty cheap, I have to say. It's gonna be over an hour ride, guys, so should be interesting. We'll show you the scenery on the way as well. I was actually on the wrong side, and luckily I asked him before I got into the tram, but when you come into the um, station, you can go left or right, but it wasn't marked that clearly. And it's the first time I've done it. So here we are. Oh, and I'm right on time to catch the tram. Okay, guys, perfect. Woo, that was lucky. Hey, guys, so whoops, I ended up on the wrong line somehow. So I had, to, I actually took a little circle around, guys. I was on a uh, different tram. I'm not sure how that happened. But anyway, this lady told me I had to backtrack. I had to go to this place called Lucentum. So that's where I am now. And I have to take another tram to Benidorm but i think it's coming pretty soon so once again we'll show you the scenery on our way to benidorm guys a little detour today to Benidorm finally I'm excited to be here a lot of people getting off the train here or the tram and that was actually a nice ride along the coast so I'm excited guys to see Benidorm I'm gonna be my first time here so here I am here in Benidorm guys and it looks like I'm on a main street here and I'm gonna head down to the beach I think it's this way hopefully there we go so we got two beaches here. It says uh, Poniente and Levante. So one one way and one the other way. I can go left or right here. I guess I'm gonna go to the right, guys. Let's check that one out. A lot of my followers, I know you guys love Benidorm. So guys, I was trying to check my phone and it was actually a little curb here or something and I actually went down and I fell, guys. Wow. And I kind of scraped up my arm. You can kind of see it there. Luckily, it's not bleeding, but I did kind of uh, like smash the corner of my phone. You could probably see that there, wow. So unfortunately, that's what happened here in Ben or so far. Let's hope I'm gonna have better luck, guys. I guess it could have happened anywhere. And that's actually what I tripped on there, guys. I wasn't expecting that. There's like a lip here, and they don't normally have that. So I was stepping here, and I went over this edge here. There's a Mercadona, Burger King, and I think I saw the beach was to the right. 
but let's see what happens when we get down to the beach, guys. So far, it doesn't look like any, anything that special. I saw tons of apartments uh, along the way. Some of those views were just fantastic. And the water was so blue, guys. The water was so, so gorgeous and blue. I can see that from the tram. Just looked amazing. Look at all the apartments over here. Tons of apartments here. Okay, so I can see the way to the beach. That's great. My camera's still working. That is also good. So I have to be honest with you guys. My first impressions are nothing too special. This actually looks kind of not that pretty actually really here. Starting to see a little bit more people and maybe a little bit nicer part of town, hopefully. So let's go. Can't wait to see the beach in Benidorm. And I've seen a lot of tourist shops here and places here selling goods and souvenirs and all kind of things there there you go definitely a more touristic feel here we've got a lot of people here but i'll have to say i'm still hearing a lot of spanish so maybe a lot of spanish people are on holiday here as well in benidorm guys a lot of older folks for, for sure a lot of older people i can see that look like retired people and some big big chinese shops guys selling all kind of goods Thanks for the beach. Looks like they have flamenco show here. Some kind of big cafe or restaurant. A Burger King. And sounds like there's some music in there right now. It says live music here. We're very close to the beach now. Wow. It's gonna be exciting to see the beach here. And along this whole coast here in Alicante. Wow, beautiful beaches, guys. And on the way, I saw a lot of nice beaches and there wasn't that many people on them so that's awesome that's awesome and i also saw a lot of land that was undeveloped of course a lot of apartment buildings and a lot of development going on here so i'm seeing several tourist bus guys coming through here a lot of tourist bus so they must be busting in the tourists to take a look at benidorm or to stay here that's the second or third large bus that i just saw it looks like a tourist bus for sure and there's another one going by the beach guys you can see that so very very touristic here which is what i was expecting and here we are here's a hotel here corona del mar okay so crown of the sea uh, 10 euros for breakfast 16 euros for lunch buffet and wow there's a huge rock out there guys look at that and I think I did see something on the map that that's a lookout point. So maybe there's some kind of uh, boat that takes you out there or like a ferry. So that is actually giving me some vibes of Gibraltar. Look at that, guys. Almost like a mini Gibraltar out there. How about that? That is really cool, that rock. Now, here we are, guys. This is much more beautiful here. We have a big hotel here. It's called Hotel via del mar very nice look at this now this is gorgeous okay now i see why people come here i was starting to worry that i was in the wrong place guys but apparently i'm not so let's take a look here let's walk along here and wow <laughs> what a beautiful place and look at this in the distance oh gosh look at that guys just gorgeous look at this and look at the beach Oh my gosh, look at all the people on the beach, enjoying it. And that is just beautiful in the distance there. I don't know if that is, we passed a city called Via Hoyosa. So I'm not sure if that is Via Hoyosa. This is probably just part of Benidorm. Look at that guys, that is beautiful. We got some of those uh, greyhounds there, very popular in Spain. I like those dogs and look at all the people on the beach. And it's not too windy here. Wow, it's nice here. And I think it's kind of um, protected from the wind because you have kind of a cove here, guys. You see that? So I can see why people like it here. Very calm, the waves. And yeah, this is beautiful, guys. This is paradise here in Spain. And this is what the uh, foreigners come from, guys. This is what they come for. The people from England, the people from ireland the people from uk the people from all over guys they come here to a benidorm gorgeous place look at this guys look at this beach 
Absolutely fantastic. Take a look at that. That is perfection there. Oh my. Which makes you want to go dive in. So let's take a little walk down this uh, promenade here. We've got some uh, restaurants here. We got a little bit of everything here. And some beautiful palm trees over there. Very nice. I can see in the distance there, it looks like a ferry guy is right there. So I guess that ferry is taking people out to that to that rock or that little island there. I don't know what they have on it, but they must have something. Maybe some uh, restaurants or bars. That would be kind of cool, guys. Wow. And you've got all kind of apartments here. Take a look at all the apartments. Wow, it's just full of life here, guys. Absolutely full of life. So relaxing here. Look at this. Guys, this is just fabulous. Wow. And I've seen some videos of Benidorm before, but being here is just a whole nother thing, guys. It's so nice here. And it seems very tranquil. And just get a calm, nice feeling here, guys. And of course, the nice warm sun. What a great time to be here in Benidorm. I like the feel of this here. It feels like you're walking through a garden almost. Look at this, a garden of palm trees. Wow, and that gives a lot of shade, guys. I'll have to say it's quite, it's quite a bit cooler here. A lot of shade, some places for the children to play. You've got the apartment so, so close. That would be a fantastic place to have an apartment here. Just overlooking the beach. Look at this. This is fantastic, guys. Unbelievable. This is nice. I think it reminds me a little bit of Benel Madena. That's the only thing I can compare it to. But in a way, it's nicer. It is really nice here in Benidorm. Looks like some more hotels over here. And more restaurants. Look at that. And here we go, guys. So it's called Isla de Benidorm or Benidorm Island in English. So a little tiny island there. Looks like some um, sailors like it, some boaters. And I guess you just go there and just hang out. I don't know, guys. But there is a ferry that takes you there. It doesn't say the price. So now we kind of get this little town feel here. We've got some streets going there, but all the action is on this street here. So a little street here in Benidorm. And some shops open. Here's an ice cream shop. Looks like another restaurant. Chocolate shop, chocolate and candy, there we go. And you really got to be careful with these kind of shops, guys, because they usually sell the candy by the uh, pound or by the um, by the gram, I think, guys, and it actually is quite expensive normally. So it's kind of, um, they overcharge you for the candy a lot of times, guys. So be careful there. Here's a restaurant here, pretty full. It's called uh, Cordoba got the lobster there and they've got a menu of the day for $13.90 so a little bit more expensive here than in other parts of Spain not really surprised by that it is Benidorm very touristic there's a sign there guys we love Benidorm so nice and I'm starting to love this place myself guys Benidorm great place look at this look at all the people here just loving it guys, look at this. A lot of crepe shops. A lot of crepe and waffle. Wow, those look good, look at that guys. Oh my gosh. 
Just so much to see and do here in Benidorm. And we're heading back down toward the beach now. Gonna see another part of Benidorm. A lot of sweet shops around too. What do we have here? Let's take a look here. What do we have? Empanadas, some croissants, some cinnamon rolls. There we go. Some sandwiches. Hola. <laughs> a little bit of everything there. And I think it's a little bit cheaper here on this street than it was over there by the beach or the first spot I was, guys. Seems like so many apartments. Look at all the apartments here. I think that a lot of foreigners like to come here and retire. And here we go. Here's a British flag up there. So some British people there. Look at this. Look at all the restaurants here. And I think these are cheaper eats here, guys. I saw a few things for a euro, two euros. So won't break the bank here. Everyday food. Oh my gosh, look at this guy. So it appears we've uh, crossed over, going through the uh, streets there, and we're on the other side of this big rock there. Look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Look at this, just keeps going. Look at this beautiful area over here. Wow, guys, Benidorm is really cool. I'm gonna give a big thumbs up to Benidorm, guys. Look at this, and I think this is the coolest part yet look at this oh yeah the party is going guys here in benidorm so i've walked a little bit further up guys by the uh big towers now take a look and there's this uh bar here wow guys this is really happening this one look at that look at all the people there big party there check it out wow this is a party spot guys benidorm and like I said, I'm closer to these uh, towers now. Look at that, look at that. That is definitely where a lot of people are staying or living or renting. It's just beautiful. And some more of these bars here. I'm definitely hearing a lot more English now than before. So this must be the spot. Look at that. Look at this paradise here. Look at this huge tall building here. Take a look at that. Wow, these are really big buildings. When you get up close, you can really see how large they are. Look at that, guys. And let's walk out here on the beach a little bit, guys. Take a look at this. How about that? Oh my gosh. Oh my. What a view that is. What a fantastic view to my right. And hello to everyone that's watching me today. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're having a great day. And I hope you're enjoying a beautiful place like this. This is fantastic. Look at this. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. So I think the reputation of Benidorm is very much justified, guys. It is a fabulous place. If you get a chance, I would definitely recommend it. So we'll see you in the next video. A travel addict, a guy. Take care, everyone.